So, usually before I introduce the singers, I talk about the men and women in the United States Armed Forces who are my heroes. Yeah. yeah. There's another group of men and women who are equally as important to me, because without them, well, this would not be. Now, the folks on top of the stage here, our job starting around the beginning of September where Paul O'Neill tells us what we're doing, what songs. We work really, really, really hard and we try to play the right notes in the right order and sing and bring his story and John will leave his story to life every night. How do we do with that, by the way? <laughs> and I get to stand up here and introduce some of the most fabulous musicians on the planet. <clears throat> and everybody looks at us and goes, you guys are just amazing! Woo! Which is true, by the way. <laughs> But there's a whole group of people, probably five or six times more than us, that make our jobs possible. Their job will probably start around February 1st, where our boss Paul and Neil will have a napkin or some Denny's somewhere in Florida, and he's going to draw this thing. And everybody's going to go, Lord have mercy, he's at it again. Except these people who you don't really know who live underneath the stage make it happen. So uh, I have the privilege of introducing half of them. The other half do 13 colonies. They do that tour. We have the privilege of coming to Texas. Yeah! 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 So I don't want to talk about it tonight. A very dear friend of mine, she's in the audience. She told me once, don't tell me, show me. So ladies and gentlemen, if you wouldn't mind, I'd love to introduce you to the greatest road crew on the planet. Woo! We'll bring it out right now. We figured out at the front of the house over there with all the lining up stuff. Yeah. Merry Christmas! If I could do this every night for you guys, I would. I can't, but I want to do it this one night. God bless every one of you as you make my job a privilege to do. Thank you for the Bible for all my stars. First of all, I gotta introduce you to the greatest rock and roll band I've ever had the privilege of working with. So, thanks, Jack. Helping us out the 